Hello everyone. It has been a while since we last communicated by YouTube. I hope you are all doing well and I hope 2022 has been a wonderful year for you all. And I wish you all a very happy new year 2023. Today I just wanted to look back on what 2022 looked like. As you may remember, I had made a video at the very beginning of 2022 uh, where I discussed about my new year resolutions for this year. And I'll put a link to that video right here. Uh, but I watched my own video and I see that I had made a couple of a number of resolutions. And it seems like I have been on the right track. Uh, a couple of things that I had told one was making YouTube videos more regularly. I have not been able to do that uh, very well, but I have made more YouTube videos this year than I did in the past uh, all years combined. So, you know, I just, I'm talking about these things just to give you a sense of how it works out in the real world, in, in real practice. It did not go perfectly according to my plan. I did not make a YouTube video every week um, because life happens, so many things happen. But at least because of that resolution, I made more YouTube videos this year than all other years combined in the past. Uh, so we are definitely in the in the right direction. And uh, I talked about swimming. I think I swam more last year or uh, this year than I had swam in previous years. I'm learning swimming. And this year, I I think I had even put a video on my Facebook about this. I, I uh, was not, uh, I could get away from my fear about diving in water and you know uh, diving in swimming pools at uh, uh, at a good depth uh, and being able to just swim and having that confidence that I won't drown uh, immediately if I um, and if I was dropped in the middle of a lake at least I would survive for a few minutes before uh, drowning uh, and I'm still working on that like these are not things that will happen in one year but at least making a resolution helped to go a little farther than if I had not made any resolution at all. The other was about music. I think I actually made a good progress uh, in learning the piano. Uh, I, I guess I'm not good enough that I would make a video of it and, and display it. Um, but I am pretty happy with uh, where I am about my piano skills comparing uh, myself uh, from a couple of years ago where I had zero knowledge about music. I had absolutely no knowledge about uh, how the world of music worked. And now I'm able to play mm, a number of favorite songs uh, in the piano. So I'm, I'm happy with that. Um, and the other thing that I had discussed uh, at the beginning of the year was about uh, uh, financial awareness and I think uh, I'm on good track uh, over there as well um, a number of things that I wanted to do uh, last year but I could not do was a make more YouTube videos um, in fact I wanted to share a number of things one uh, the books that I read uh, and uh, you know synthesis of knowledge from those books or things I have learned uh, this week um, and also some videos about just cancer awareness, uh, including in Nepali language for the public about what is cancer, how cancer happens, what we can do about it, how to prevent cancer, or what to do after we have had uh, a diagnosis of cancer. So those are things that I wanted to do, uh, but did not have the time to. I wanted to build a website. Uh, again, did not have the time to. Um, but uh, these are things that uh, I can... Uh, work on for next subsequent years uh, but uh, anyways this video was just to uh, recap and go back to the previous video at the beginning of the year where i talked about new year resolutions um, and then to uh, let the audience know where i am with these resolutions a and b to give an example of uh, how resolutions work and why it is important to have resolutions it does not mean that you will achieve all of them it does not go as smoothly as you planned uh, several things happen in life. Life never goes according to plan, but at least having some guideposts uh, about where you want to go, that will help um, compared to not having any guideposts at all. Uh, 
and yeah, one of the resolutions that I spectacularly failed was losing weight. I have not been able to. So that is an important resolution for my next year. So next year around this time, uh, I'll make another video to uh, tell you where I am with my weight loss uh, resolution. I traveled a lot uh, in 2022 compared to previous years because there was COVID in previous years. And in 2022, after the world opening up, I resumed my travel. And as you travel, your uh, resolutions about what you are going to eat, how much you are going to exercise, uh, it's a little difficult to balance those goals. But yeah, those are just excuses, I guess. If I really want to, I should be able to. So I'll get back to you guys, 2023, December. And I hope at that time I'll be able to tell you that, yes, I have lost a good amount of weight and I'm more active than ever. I'm more fit than ever. Um, so, yeah, that's it. Um, I hope you all had a wonderful 2022 and wish you all a very happy new year, 2023. Every new year is a wonderful opportunity to start your life new, to begin new things in life to get a new perspective of life and to work towards uh, a new goal, a new passion, a new hobby. In fact, every day is a new opportunity. Every hour is a new opportunity. Whatever is bygone, let them be bygones. Every day is a fresh new opportunity to create something new, to be a new person, to live a new life. Every day is the start of your new life. So... I hope uh, you have a good um, 2023 and every single day.